A family, a team, and a university all in mourning tonight over the life taken too soon. More than 1,000 people gathered to remember Dwayne Simmons, a Washburn University football player and Lee Summit native. Yeah, someone shot and killed Dwayne Simmons and wounded his friend as they celebrated his friend's selection to the New York Giants. New at 10, 41 Action News reporter Dia Wall is in Topeka where a vigil for Dwayne wrapped up tonight. Family, faith, and football. Everyone here says that's what mattered most to Dwan Simmons. So tonight, Washburn University honored him with all three because they say his light will always shine bright here. Even the skies above the field where Dwan Simmons played cried. It really touched us to see all these people turn out for him today. Tuesday night, 1,300 people gathered at Washburn University to honor the man who meant so much. There's beauty in this room and we have to protect him. The love of all the people that he touched, that's remarkable. Early Sunday morning, Simmons was leaving a party with his friend and roommate, Corey Ballantyne, when he was shot and killed. Quite honestly, I got mad about it because I'm tired of senseless killing. The mood was one of strength, support, and the joy Dwan brought to each of these lives. And y'all know you was a bit yeah. He'll crack on you in a minute. <laughs> there were tears, but tonight, a break in the clouds and a beautiful sky showing the rainbow in the midst of this storm. It was a purpose for us to be down there on that field, and so he did That's that for God's us. Work. That is God's work. The head football coach announced that the team will honor Dwan on their jerseys this upcoming season. There will also be a scholarship endowed in his honor here at Washburn University forever. In Topeka, Dia Wall, 41 Action News. Dewan's friend, Corey Ballantyne, was released from the hospital today. Officers have made no arrests in this shooting. Yeah, meanwhile, another vigil and balloon release will be held for Dewan here in his hometown. It'll be at Lee Summit West football field on Thursday at 7 p.m. Dewan will be laid to rest Saturday.